Hello and welcome to another project panning update of mine. Yes, yes, this is the roulette pen collab update that I am, or the roulette pen collab project pen that I'm still doing. <laughs> this was created by Rebecca Morgan and Alexi. As always, I'm going to link both of them down in the description box. Um, I am still doing this project with the 100 prompts. I think this was the roulette pen collab 2.0 or something and I have about 56 prompts left now and I want to go for all of them. <laughs> I didn't update for a little bit because I kind of got annoyed with this project and this is one item why I got annoyed. <laughs> so within this update I am doing something that I normally won't do. I am rolling out two items. For me to make it exciting again and for me to start this one back up because I still want to get through all of these prompts. <laughs> so yeah, um, starting off, oh no, I wanted to mention another project panel that is I think still doing this as well and that's Metropolitan Creole. I'm going to link her up in the eye and also down in the description box in case you want to see another person that is still doing this project. So let's start with this one. This is a lipstick sample from MAC in the shade MAC Red. And this was in here for the prompt, a product that reminds you of your favorite Disney villain. My goal was to use this up. Obviously I did not do so. This has been in here for probably one and a half years or so. And I, uh, I didn't even hit pen. I think I'm a little bit close to hitting pen. It's all dust in here. Uh, I don't want to really show you. Um, I did not even hit pen. So <laughs> I am rolling this out. This kind of annoys me now. So yeah, I don't really wear red lipsticks. Just very, very rarely I do wear them. So yeah, this is rolling out of this project. The second item that I was working on is this Kat Van D liquid lipstick in the shade Lovecraft. And this was in here for a product that everyone hates but you love. And I decided to go with a liquid lipstick because I think a lot, a lot of people don't enjoy liquid lipsticks anymore, but I still do. And my goal is to use this 30 times. I am at 23 uses now, so this is still staying. I need to use it seven more times. For the prompt, a product with a bad functioning packaging, I did roll in this The Body Shop Honey Browser not too many updates ago. My goal was to use this up completely. Um, bad functioning packaging because it broke. <laughs> I am at this stage now and I have to tell you that I did declutter this browser which annoyed me so so much. <laughs> um, I really really wanted to finish this one but I think this kind of broke me up but now I'm thinking it might be a different product but still I already decluttered this so I'm staying with my decision so this is running out of this project because basically I already decluttered this out of my collection, I think two months ago or so. Next up, a product you feel indifferent about. And for me, that's the Biolash Colorless Shine Shake. And when rolling this one in, I was at the B. First update of having this one in, I was at the A. Then I was at Shine Shake. And now I'm down here. I think around where the milliliters um, are mentioned. And this one will be done till the next update. Now I actually have an opinion about it. <laughs> when rolling this in, I really felt it different about and now I don't really enjoy it that much. It's okay, but it also makes my hair quite greasy very fast. But then again, it also makes my hair very nice the first day. <laughs> so anyway. This is staying and I want to use it up, obviously. Another The Body Shop product. This is The Body Shop Carrot Cream. And this is in here for the prompt a skincare item. I did roll this in when this was brand new. My goal is to finish this one up. And I have worked on this one for quite a few months now. Let's see. I think 
that's about it. There's quite a bit product in here, but I am at this stage of the product basically. So this will take me several months to finish this still. But yeah, I do like this cream, so this will not be hard for me to use up. And last update, I did roll in this Terra Moons Cosmetics Daybreak Single Eyeshadow for the prompt uh, in the makeup item. And this is one of, no, probably the most favorite eyeshadow I do own in my collection. My goal is to hit pen on it. And I did use this one 16 times since the last update, which was several months ago so not within a month but still i obviously did not hit pen yet so this is staying so because i am decluttering two items out of this project this kind of feels like a little refresh for me and yeah i am able to roll in two new items that i'm going to do now i have 56 prompts left I already randomly chose two numbers. The first number was 51 and that corresponded to the prompt a glitter liquid shadow or pigment and I'm showing you now what I'm rolling in. I'm rolling in another eyeshadow. This is a liquid eyeshadow from Gloss Gods and it's in the shade Let Me Love You. And wait, I'm going to swatch all of these. Um, yeah, let's swatch. I'm going to swatch the liquid lipstick for you to see the colors. I'm going to swatch this daybreak shade. And I'm going to swatch this liquid eyeshadow that I'm rolling in now. So that's this liquid shadow. I only used it once or twice so far. So we will see how I will get along with this one, if this creases, how much I am able to use, if I need to lay it layer it on top of another shade or something. Um, for this one I thought I will set myself a goal of using this 15 times which is quite a lot especially because I don't know if I really enjoy this one. I have another one of these that I really enjoy but I don't know if this is the same formula. And last but not least I wrote in the number 7 which corresponded to the prompt a product you bought because of the hype and for me that's this NARS cream bronzer in the shade Laguna 1 and you can see it's basically brand new I used it twice once to try it out and the second time actually using it to go out and I just noticed that my powder stuck to it way more than on the other parts of my face. So ever since then I didn't dare to try it again, but I want to figure this one out. So my goal will be to use this 30 times because now it's the perfect time for me. Um, when I have a little bit of a drier skin, I think cream product, I think cream products will be nice. Um, so yeah, I want to figure this one out and use it 30 times. And if you have any suggestions using this one, um, do you lay it on top of your powder items? Do you powder after using this? I don't get it. <laughs> Let me know how you use this. So yes, that's already it for this update. These are the new items that I, I have in here. I think since, till the next update I will be finishing this Biolash Shine Shake and either the KVD liquid lipstick using the seven more times or hitting pen on the daybreak shade. We will see. I hope you enjoyed this 
And if you know anyone else that is still doing this, or if you are somebody that is still doing this, then let me know because I love this and I would definitely check your videos out or even your Instagram post if you're doing this over on Instagram. Okay, but now <laughs> that's it. I hope you're doing fine and I wish you a very nice day. Bye.